Now is the time when autumn is refreshing and uplifting. Try to, climb to, to climb to the peak of Dalka Mountain, and as you look around, the mountains in the south resemble a line of swords, capable of inspiring ambition. The Yangtze River in the north resembles a vast belt, where one can spread the wings of thought. Looking far into Gusu, the command post of Zhou Yu is vividly in sight. Looking closer at Fu Fu Mountain, the traces of Lan Wang's fortress have already vanished. All of these are enough to broaden one's horizons and stir emotions. There are also those simple small towns. The scenes of harvest, the flocks of geese in autumn, and the falling leaves, all are natural wonders, all capable of inspiring thought. When you go back to write, although you may not be able to produce works as majestic and generous as Tushang, you can at least come close. Otherwise, following the masses in search of disaster tales will not only be unhelpful for learning, but will also spread superstitious thoughts. How vulgar that is. Off you go. Strive in your studies. I want to see what you can reap.